hello viewers bar welcome in this youtube channel this is question from j means based on newton's law of motion as per given figure a weightless pulley p is attached on a double inclined frictional surface the tension in the string will be so student here a double inclined plane is given so first we make its free body diagram so let it is the first inclined surface so it's here it is 60 so it's beats work in downward direction here it is also 60 so this is mg cos 60 and this is mg sin 60 m is 4 and this is the reaction r1 and this is the tension t okay and the second is it is 30 and the body is here so its weight is mg m is 1 kilogram m1g here it is act m1g cos 30 m1g sin 30 and this is r2 and here tension is t now taking the using Newton's second law F equal to MA so the resultant force because motion is done in this direction so that acceleration is a so mg sin 60 minus t equal to ma okay and uh, here this is m is 4 4 g sin 60 minus t equal to 4 a this is our first and for this t minus m1 is 1 kilogram here so 1 g sin 30 my equal to 1 into a so making them equal first we multiply this by 4 so operating as 1 minus 4 into second so 4g sin 60 minus t equal to 4a and this is 4t minus 4g sin 30 equal to 4a now subtracting minus plus minus so this is cancel out and we got here this minus t and minus 40 this is minus 5t and this is 4g sin 60 plus 4g sin 30 equal to 0 so 5t equal to 4g is common sin 60 plus sin 30 t equal to 4 upon 5 g sin 60 is under root 3 by 2 and sin 30 is 1 by 2 and g is also given here which is 10 meter per second square which is 10 and this is root 3 plus 1 by 2 so 5 2 ja 10 2 2 ja 4 so t equal to 4 into under root 3 plus 1 newton 4 into under root 3 plus 1 newton so 4 into 3 root 3 plus 1 is found in option b therefore option b is correct i hope you got it please like the video subscribe the channel thanks for